What's up? It's me, a floater here. And I decided to make a video on a topic I've been thinking about for a while. And just, just kind of now wondering, like, why? And that's cell shaded figures. And, and, and I don't want to say in general, mainly more focused on Hasbro and their whole line of cell shaded figures. And I think they're also called their retro figures or whatever. Or vintage figures even though we have like two other lines in the past with that same purpose why why do they push so hard to sell these guys and are they actually good figures worth getting and personally in my opinion I think they're I think it's a is a pointless line I don't think anyone actually wants these figures and if they do they want it they want a certain character that just happens to be cell shaded and that that's the only line to get that character for example they gave us a new Jim Lee Cyclops figure <clears throat> great great I love I, I, I love to have that Cyclops figure but here's the thing it's cell shaded I would just like to have a normal Cyclops with that new uh, Vulcan body mold but it has that crap on it and in my honest opinion it may, it, for some, it, it may look good. For others, I don't think it looks that great. I don't think they, they do it quite right. I just, I just think there's something off with it that just doesn't work for some of these Marvel Legends. For example, they've given us another symbiote Spider-Man, which is cool and all, but, like, it just looks worse. It just looks worse. It doesn't look that much better. You want a Spider-Man with a blue tint or purple tint, Use some lighting or something or, or airbrush it or or, or do it some dry brushing Doing those weird little patterns on it just doesn't work. Honestly. It just doesn't work. It just looks bad It just I don't know and they, they keep Keep releasing some of these newer figures and they, they will release these figures with usually <clears throat> Less accessories less accessories and a higher price point and it looks uglier It's like, it, what, what's the point? It's, it's like they're just trying to get easy money. For example, this Carnage, this, this Venom, this Carnage Spider-Man 2-pack. The only thing I like about this 2-pack is that maybe, you know, the Carnage could be a little better. This is basically a new Carnage without the... Your new classic Carnage, I guess. That's the cool thing about it. And it comes with... Okay, it comes with a decent amount of stuff. It comes with his axes, his it basically comes with an extra head, Cleus Cassidy head, hands, and an axe. That axe in the main part, that's that's pretty exciting. And then that's it. Um the Spider-Man comes with two sets of hands, and there you go. I'm not saying like this 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 pack is $53. And I guess for nowadays that's better than what we've been seeing for other two packs but honestly for, for, for $53 and you're probably gonna have to you know this is on Hasbro Pulse this is a Pulse exclusive I think so it's probably gonna be it's gonna be roughly around $63 is that really worth it I think you're better off is getting an older Carnage figure that you could probably find on clearance somewhere or that that us uh, that other symbiote spider-man though I only difference is this Spider-Man, in my in honest opinion, it does not look as good as the original we got. But the, the other symbiote Spider-Man is going like for roughly around $35 right now. Maybe a little cheaper than that. I could be wrong. So you would be getting more out of your value for buying this two-pack. It's just uglier figures, in my opinion. Just kind of downgrades. And they keep putting noise, putting advertisement on more figures. How about you just focus on something else? You know, I don't know. I, I guess I got, got my point across. I'm just not the biggest fan of these these cell shaded figures, and I'm mainly making this video because it's disappointed me that they're giving us some cool X Men figures. Mainly again, the Jim Lee Cyclops, uh, the Uncanny Cyclops, or whatever, and it comes on. It looks great. It looks great, but it has the cell shaded. Why would you give us a new Cyclops figure, a character that most people wanted to upgrade in their collection, but Force them to get the cell shader version. Well, you're going to release it. You're going to re just release the same figure 
in the future about the cell shading and probably for a more expensive price in some sort of two pack i just i like they're just trapping people and i don't appreciate it but uh that's that's it so uh, yeah